Oh, good afternoon. Now, uh, look at the Caulfield Cup and we'll get that going. Look, I'll start by spelling it right. How's that? Okay, Caulfield Cup 2018. Uh, and we're doing this for www.horseracingaustralia.info. So I can give you a broad look first uh, from the program I'm using. And you can see here um, that I've got three horses here uh, right in the market. Uh, well, sorry, right in my market. Uh, Gallic Chief Homes and Ventura Store. Uh, followed by Night's Watch, then there's a bunch of them way back here, most of which are in the market. Now, as a matter of interest, I'll just uh, switch back to our Horse Racing Today um, selections, and we can see clearly we've got uh, Kingsville Dream and Young Star uh, would be the main two in it, along with uh, Patrick Aaron, Night's Watch and Homesman. If we switch back to my Winform ratings, we'll, we'll have a look at them here. Just a few comments uh, that I can add in. I've got uh, Gallic Chieftain on top, and uh, it's currently $61 into $51 in the market, so a very good price. And um, I've listed the top 10 here, but I like the form of the ch uh, Chieftain. Is well beaten last start, and more was expected. Uh, didn't suit him the way the race turned out. Uh, of course, we saw Yucatan take off and clear out on them all. But his uh, last two has uh, got him near what his previous peak was. The barrier draws the biggest obstacle but he might be able to find a uh, reasonable spot coming along the outside um, and get a, a comfortable cart into the field. Uh, Ventura Storm has been improving steadily. Should have won the Australian Cup earlier this year. Got blocked for a run uh, that was behind Harlem. And uh, the time they ran in that race was absolutely sensational. Need a bit of luck in the run. And Holmesman, I was impressed with him. I've tipped Holmes from the last two or three runs, but last run was a little bit disappointing. What he needs is to be sitting just off the pace and he will be all right if he can run the distance. That's something we don't know. And the night's watch. Okay, what happened last start? He was running out of his skin, but uh, was the class too good for him last start? And of course, it's his first time over 2,400 metres too. So that makes it a bit of a difficult race. Uh, Benga Mask. Um, I like this horse. Uh, it's Maloney trained, Maloney rides. This is a distance that suits it, and the thing is it can sit on the pace all day. So um, I've got it as a $25 chance, yet uh, you can easily get 100 to 1 or better. You can get $25 uh, just for a place. And um, Kings Will Dream, what I didn't like last start was the way he gave up second place. I'm not sure if that was the uh, jockey not urging him on well enough, or was it that he... Um, was just as I thought, a little bit disappointing. So he's the favourite for the race. Uh, Kings War Dream is six dollars into five dollars. Uh, Young Star was very good um, last preparation. Uh, was a good second behind Winks, obviously cutting Kings War Dream out of the uh, sorry, uh, yeah, cutting Kings War Dream out of the second place. And uh, Young Star is five fifty to six dollars. And John Snow, which was uh, really right in it last year, forty one dollars into thirty five dollars. Okay, uh, all in all, I haven't even mentioned Jimmy. I don't like Ace High. The the race, the uh, horse seems to be racing a bit sourly. He could improve, of course. Uh, it's a long, uh, long time between now and Saturday. And uh, of the others, there are a few there coming from overseas, which are um, having their first start in Australia, but nothing that um, has uh, really excited me all that much, except perhaps this one. And that's... Uh, it ran a 71.7 for us last Saturday. That was behind uh, Ben Battle. It was slowly away. And uh, there is a possibility that this one could improve and drawn barrier two. Um, that would be a big, big help, although it does seem to get back. Okay, that's what I have for you. All the best. And uh, let's hope we can uh, nail another long shot winner like we did last year. 50 to 1 last year. Let's see if we can get another 50 to 1, which would be Gallic Chieftain. Don't hold your breath, though. Good luck, and thanks for